and to come back and get his chosen seed line, man. Uh, you know? Right. Uh, I don't know what that said. But uh, I'm going to get this uh, Jeremiah 15, 33 through 34. It says, um, Jeremiah 50, 33 through 34. It says, God. Thus said the Lord Yahweh of hosts, the children of Israel and the children of Judah were oppressed together. And all that took them captive, held them fast, they refused to let them go. And, then, and that, that goes into, you know, these Edomite, they quick to say, you could just go back to where you come from. <laughs> you know, that's your lower level, that's your lower level devil's yeah. opinion, man. We can just go back to where we come from. But the elites, they don't want us to go back to where we come from, man. You know, they want to keep, they want to keep making... Uh, what, what is called merchandise of us, man. You know, because we make them lots and lots and lots of money, man. They wouldn't be in the place that they're in without us, man. You know, we make all the we make we make these elites they money, man. And some of you lower, some of you lower level devils do too, man. That done sold out. You know, but basically the Israelites, man. You know, because we are we are blessed beyond measure, man, and they know that. So I'm going to keep reading. It says, um, you know, they refuse to let us go. And then um, another thing, man, how can we, how can, how can the most poorest person of our nation go back, man? When they, when they, when they being oppressed by, oppressed systematically, man. You know, this is systematic oppression, man. You know, holding, holding the so-called black man down where he can't get a good job, you know. You know, the hell with the education because the, the wisdom of this world is foolishness to the most high. You know? But you know, red ball red ball in the so called black man, putting him in, in ghettos and in slums, you know. Put you in the worst conditions and expect come. you to, to come out and be successful. Come, come. But these devils, like the scriptures say shit, they pass they suck down to their babies. Exactly, man. man. You know, we we'll, we we'll, don't Get nothing to where we can really just pass stuff down. Come, you know come. these fucking devils die. They leaving hundreds and hundreds of acres. Come, business, land, business, land, you know, houses, houses, come, real estate. Mm -hmm. Shit, they leave they subs to their babies, man. When these devils die, they hand that shit down to their children. Mm -hmm. And why we can't hold them down? Because we've been oppressed all this long time, man. Motherfuckers getting million dollars. When they turn 18, their grandparents or something that they got another couple million, right. hundreds of thousands. Right. You know, all of them ain't the same rich, you know, because mm -hmm. the Lord don't, he, he deal in portions, you know. Mm -hmm. But shit, they get something. Yep. That's shit, right. our parents that we lucky to goddamn get a damn <laughs> dollar, man. Come. You Come. know. Come. Shit, you ain't finna get no house unless they been, it's regular or something, you know, kind of yep. ran down. You might, you got a couple of Jakes who, more well off, mm -hmm. you know. But shit, what they got? What? Why? It don't. If your whole nation is poor, shit, that shit don't mean that. Come. Everybody else fucking broke. Yeah, you might get you a, a meal or something if your parents not. Come. You know, some people didn't work their way up to be successful. But mm -hmm. shit, for the most part, the whole nation is through, man. Come. Come. You know. And not only through. not only that, you know, they work their way up to being successful. You know, they they probably sold out, man. Yeah. Because you can't really be successful in Esau's kingdom, man, without selling out to him, man. You know? This is Esau's kingdom, man. You know? You can't do nothing on your own, really, man, because you're being held down. You got to sell out to him, man. You know? Let's see if I got it more on that. Yeah, it says, uh, there it, it says, they refuse to let them go. But verse 34, their redeemer, that that word redeemer, man, when it says no man shall buy you, it goes into that word redeem. It says, their redeemer is strong. The Lord of hosts is his name. He shall thoroughly plead their cause that he may give rest to the land and disquiet the, dis, the, disquiet the inhabitants of Babylon. And that's what's going to do, man. Babylon is going to be disquieted, man. You know, especially when that thermonuclear destruction come, man. And then Yahweh shall show up with those angels, man. And those so-called UFOs, man. You know, when World War Three start, man. Let's see if I got it. Okay, I got Exodus 15 and 3. Uh, I grab that. You get John 4 and 22. Nah, that wasn't it. We say John. 
Yeah, John 4 and 22. I'm going to get this Exodus 15 and 3 right quick. This is uh, the book of Exodus, chapter 15, verse 3. It says, The Lord is a man of war. The Lord, Yahweh, is his name. You know, he is a man of war, man, and that's what he's getting ready to bring to this place ultimately, man. War. You know, it, take, it takes war to free up a nation, man. How you think so-called America got its Independence Day, man? Through war, man. Through war. How you think the Israelites going to get their independence, man? Through war. Through war through the Heavenly Father, man. And our big brother, Yahweh Shai, man, is going to be leading the charge. <laughs> This, uh, and this this war ain't gonna be no normal uh, World War Two war. This is gonna be a great, exceeding great war. It's gonna be civil war and uh, all at one time. Uh, World, World War, war. Time. you know, shit. Uh, the animals gonna be going to war against you, wicked people. Uh, it's gonna be de demonic <laughs> and fleshly war. Uh, I'm talking about it's gonna be some war going on. Real war. Right man. now it's just a spiritual war, but this shit mm -hmm. gonna get goddamn up and up in your face personally. Uh, uh, like the Lord said, I will repay them to they face that hate me, man. Uh, the Lord is gonna pay you nation, two thirds of you people. He gonna pay he gonna repay you to your face, man. He gonna be right mm -hmm. there in your face like yo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now what? The prophet's been telling you this, now what? Shit, what you gonna do now? Come. Call upon Jesus and the Christ and God, you Through. know. Call upon all them people, man. Through. Call upon Allah. Through. You know, Kevin Gates. Through. <laughs> Shit, go call mm -hmm. upon goddamn Allah. Or whatever the fuck he was saying. Come. Go call upon those false deities, man. Then that fool you had know? the nerve to say we were Israelites. Yeah, we man, were Israelites. How the hell you going to be <laughs> black and then now you white? Come. That's like I was black, but she said, nah, now I'm white. Come. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that shit don't we were Hebrew Israelites. I was Chinese, yeah, but not shit. I'm, I'm African. Come on, man. Laos, man. No man, dude. Good, man. If our These gospel be hidden, it's hidden to those who are lost, man. That's right, man. You know, like the scriptures say, man. Uh, yeah, you can get that, John. 4 22. Um, This John chapter 4 and verse 22. Ye worship, ye know not what. We know what we worship. For salvation is of the Jews, um, you know. And that's, that's basically self-explanatory, man. Who are the Jews, man? The so-called Negroes, man. Uh, Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, man. Uh, Jew is short for Judah. You know, not even not even all of Israel are Jews, man. The Northern Kingdom are not Jews, man. The okay. Jews are the so-called Negroes, man. Uh, but that's ultimately, ultimately, it's talking about both tribes. Because you know? uh, uh, uh. Judah... That's that's the head tribe. Man. Come, you come, know? Come. Salvation is for the Jews, and who are the ultimately all of, all of us? We are, we not the Jews, but we come. are God's chosen people, man. Come, come. You know, because Judah is the head tribe, so mm -hmm. that's why I say for salvation is for the Jews, man. Because mm -hmm. if if the Jews be saved, all nations would be saved. Because what happened? The Jews started going off, so-called um, Judah, Benjamin, and Levi started mm -hmm. going off. So the Lord opened up repentance to all of us, mm -hmm. man. You know, that's how all tribes started getting repent, got repented. Because mm -hmm. first the northern kingdom went off, then the southern kingdom went off too, man. Yep. yep. Not all all of the tribes were grafted back in, man. Yep. You know? Come on. But that's all I had. If you got something else, you can bring up. Yep, yep. So, you know, that being said, man, hopefully this lesson was edifying, man, you know, and lead to some of you Israelites into the, to repentance, man, because that's that's what it's all about, man. Remission of sins is repentance, man. And repentance, we just proved to you that repentance is only given into Israel, man. These red Hebrew Edomites, you know, the, these East Indians, you know, these Africans, they can't repent, man. They can't repent, man. Repentance is only given to Israel, man, forgiveness of sins. So with that being said, we want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shah, Bashem, Rakaqwa Dash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone who teach and rule well. Peace, blessings, and salutations to the whole elect, man. Shalom. Shalom.